Today we're going to be cutting open two ammonite fossils. We are going to be cutting in half to see what is going on on the inside. <laughs> I am so excited. And even though I am very excited, I'm actually really nervous. And the reason I'm so nervous is because this innermost chamber here, which I believe is called the umbilicus, goes into the ammonite. So we have to be very careful, very precise with our cut to cut straight through right where I'm intending so that we don't mess this area up here and we have two perfect halves. And as you can see with this ammonite, it goes in a little bit deeper. So we have to be even more careful with this one. So cut this one first and we'll see what's going on inside this ammonite. This side is intact, this side's intact, no fracturing. I'm just gonna quickly rinse, again, not gonna peek. All right, I got it all rinsed off. I am so excited to take a peek at this. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh, there is crystals inside this side here oh my gosh look at these beautiful chambers oh my gosh that is so beautiful now we get to move on to this ammonite and this is the one i'm most nervous about let's peel the band-aid though let's do it Cleaned it off with a little bit of water and didn't peek. As you can see, we made it on this side. Made it both sides. <laughs> so excited. Let's take a peek. Oh, that is much, much different than the other one. The chambers, you can see the suture lines right here are intact, but the inside of it almost looks like it's crystallized. The first one has some really amazing jersey pockets in the chambers and the second one, even though it's a little bit different, is hiding a pretty cool secret. Check this out. Yep, the center of them, where the crystals are, reacts under UV light. And you can even see these chambers a lot better <laughs> under UV. And I know you're wondering what the other one looks like under UV light, so here you go. Nothing. <laughs> there is this amazing ammonite that has druzy crystals inside these chambers. Absolutely spectacular. I am really happy with how the cuts went on those two ammonites and I'm not gonna lie, that was the most nervous I've ever been to cut anything. So I'm very happy that both of the cuts were perfect. Thank you so much for watching, bye.